Hey guys, it's Sylvia here. Welcome back to my channel. A few weeks ago, I received this pretty PR package from Box and Cosmetics with their new nude lipstick collection. And oh my goodness, I could not wait to share with you the swatches because these lipsticks are so flattering. The formula is beautiful. These are the 90s Nudes Full Force Plumping Lipsticks and they were created in partnership with the brand celebrity makeup artist Ash K. Holmes. They retail at $20 each, available at Ulta and BoxumCosmetics.com. So I will be doing swatches of all six shades here for you guys and I also went on Boxum Instagram page and I saw that they are recommending using the uh, lip liners, their lip liners with the, the different shades. So I do have three different um, lip liner shades I will be doing swatches of the lipstick itself and then I will be also applying the lip liner so you guys can see how the lipstick look, looks like with the lip liner. Alright, so the first shade I will be swatching for you is called Fly Girl and it's a peachy beige nude. Okay, so this one is a... Oh, this one is a very nude shade. Mm, the formula is really nice and creamy. Definitely um, feels very moisturizing and because it, it's also plumping, I can feel a bit of like tingling in my lips. I really like that. Who doesn't like lipstick that not only looks great, feels great, but also like, you know, plumps up your lips, right? So that's the uh, shade Fly Girl. It's definitely on a warmer nude side. Still really flattering. So next what I'm going to be using is the um, Heart Throb, and that's how it looks like. And that's a light warm nude. Alrighty, so that's how this shade looks like. Still on the warmer side, but not too warm. Alright, so the next shade is my favorite. And it was a instant love at first sight. Whenever I applied this shade, I was like, oh my gosh, this is it. I love it immediately fell in love with it and it's the uh, shade Supermodel and that's how it looks like and Supermodel is a rose nude oh my goodness I feel like it's just such a flattering universal universally flattering shade um, I feel like it will look good on anyone and I think it's a uh, and it's definitely the favorite out of all six perfect for everyday wear oh. And I love the formula, guys, like I mentioned. These lipsticks feel very creamy, very comfortable on the lips. And the tingling, it's not too strong. It's just very subtle. It's there, you know, working its charm. <laughs> working its, uh, its way to a uh, plumpier lips, I guess. But yeah, so that's the uh, shade Supermodel. And the next shade we have is called Popstar. And Popstar is described as a cinnamon brown nude so that's the uh, shade pop star oh wow this one is really pretty too this shade uh, that's the shade pop star and I have to say that I really like this one although it does not look nude on my lips it definitely looks a little bit bolder but it's really pretty very flattering as well so whenever you think about nude lipsticks, right, you think about like really nude lipsticks, but even though this one is a darker shade, it still doesn't look too harsh on, on me, I would think. So um, I'm definitely a huge fan of, of the uh, shade Popstar. So the next shade uh, I will be applying is called Dreamboat, and it's a toffee nude. So I can tell that definitely this has a... Uh, has a more of a brown undertone so let's see how it looks on my lips that's how it looks on my lips and it's actually really pretty too I feel like the entire line is like perfect for fall these are such like beautiful fall friendly lipsticks and it's crazy because I just did a video about my fall favorite like favorite fall lipsticks and I wish I had these before because I would for sure include at least two shades. I mean this one is beautiful too. 
um, very, uh, definitely has like a brownish undertone, but it's not too harsh. It's actually really pretty and I would totally rock it and I'll totally wear it. Um, so that's the uh, dream bow. And the next shade we have is called Angel and that's Angel and Angel is a rich, rich brown nude. So let's see how this one. So that's the shade Angel and it's definitely, it's definitely slightly darker. I still like it because it gives me these full vibes like I mentioned before. This one definitely it looks a little bit more on the darker side, a little bit bolder. You know, sometimes when you're like shopping for nude lipsticks, you are not sure like which shade you are. Like you don't want to end up with a lipstick that has like a wrong undertone and looks weird on you. I feel like with this collection, every single shade will look flattering on you. It just depends on if you prefer your nudes to be on the lighter side or a little bit darker. I don't really have a one shade that I don't like from this collection, even including the um, the darkest one, Angel, I feel like you, I could still pull it off and every single shade is just so beautiful for fall and winter season. Oh my goodness, it's super flattering. Um, so I'm very impressed with the quality. Overall, I really like Boxum products. Uh, I personally think that they are one of the best smelling lip products out there. Absolutely obsessed with the scents they pick for their lipsticks. Especially, I don't know if you guys heard about their full limited um, limited full collection where they came out with uh, the um, lip creams and lip polishes in like pumpkin spice latte, latte uh, scent and I think it was like apple orchard um, scents. Oh my goodness, absolutely amazing. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoy my swatches. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, if you enjoy watching it. Um, otherwise, have a great day. Take care. Bye.